Did you know that Texas barbecue's smoky, savory flavors originated from German and Czech settlers? This culinary tradition, now a cornerstone of American cuisine, started as a simple preservation method and evolved into an art form. But what's the story behind this delicious evolution? The tale of Texas barbecue, a culinary tradition steeped in history and flavor, is as rich and varied as the state itself. It all began with the early pitmasters of Texas, who were influenced by a melting pot of cultures. The story starts with the Native Americans and Spanish colonies, who introduced the concept of slow cooking meat over a fire, a rudimentary form of barbecuing. But the real twist in the tale came with the arrival of German Jex settlers in the 19th century. These immigrants brought with them a tradition of smoking meats, a practice deeply embedded in their food culture, which they adapted to the meats available in Texas, primarily beef. This fusion of culinary traditions gave birth to what we know now as Texas barbecue. In different regions of Texas, unique styles began to emerge. Central Texas, with its German heritage, became famous for its focus on beef, especially brisket, smoked over oak and served without sauce to let the meat's natural flavor shine. East Texas barbecue, influenced more by the South, saw a preference for pork and beef, chopped rather than sliced, and often bathed in a rich tomato-based sauce. South Texas, meanwhile, showcased the barbacoa tradition, with meats cooked in underground pits, a method dating back to the Native Americans and Spanish settlers. But it's not just about the meat or the method, it's the flavors that set Texas barbecue apart. What truly sets Texas barbecue apart isn't just the way it tantalizes your taste buds, it's the whole symphony of elements that come together to create something uniquely Texan. At the heart of Texas barbecue is the meat, particularly beef. Brisket, the crown jewel of Texas barbecue, is more than just a cut of meat. It's a test of a pit master's skill and patience. Slow cooked to perfection, a good brisket has a melt-in-your-mouth quality, with a rich smoky flavor that can only come with hours of cooking at low temperatures. This brings us to the art of smoking, a technique that's almost sacred in Texas barbecue circles. Using different types of wood like oak, hickory, mesquite, imparts different flavors, transforming the meat into something extraordinary. It's the slow smoking process, sometimes lasting up to 16 hours, that gives Texas barbecue its characteristically tender texture and deep, complex flavors. But let's not overlook the simplicity of seasoning. In Texas barbecue, less is often more. A good rub is usually just salt and pepper, allowing the true flavor of the meat to shine through. Complemented but not overshadowed by the smokiness. It's a minimalist approach, but don't be fooled. Achieving perfection with just these basic elements requires skill and experience. Which brings us to the Cadillac Barbecue. The story of the Cadillac Barbecue is as flavorful as its food, beginning with its founder, Todd David. Todd, who spent 30 years in the disaster cleanup business, decided to follow his passion with barbecue, and opened Cadillac in 2010. His vision was simple but yet profound create a barbecue experience that felt like a backyard gathering, where quality and community take center stage. Now, what sets Cadillac apart isn't just its mouth-watering barbecue, but its unique operational model. Open only twice a week, plus the first Saturday of each month, this limited availability isn't a gimmick. It's a testament to their commitment to quality. It's about taking the time to do things right, from hand-selecting the meats to smoking them to perfection. This schedule means the team at Cadillac, including the dedicated pit master Andrew Castellan, can focus on crafting exceptional barbecue without cutting any corners. Speaking of the menu, let's dive into what makes it so special. The brisket at Cadillac, smoked slowly and seasoned with just the right amount of salt and pepper, is the stuff of legends. It's tender, flavorful, and as some may say, like eating a piece of butter that tastes like meat. But it's not just about the brisket. The ribs and sausages are equally remarkable, each item on the menu receiving the same level of care and attention. And then there are the sides. Oh, the sides. From the creamy mac and cheese to the savory baked beans. They are as much a star of the show as the meats. 
If you've ever sunk your teeth into a tender piece of Texas brisket, you'll understand why Texas barbecue has transcended its humble beginnings to become not just a local favorite, but a culinary sensation across the globe. It's a journey from the backyards and small town smokehouses of Texas to the international stage, where it's celebrated for its bold flavors and unique cooking style. What started as a way for early Texans to make the most of lesser cuts of meat has evolved into a culinary art form, earning accolades and awards far beyond the Lone Star State. From prestigious mentions in food magazines to top rankings in barbecue competitions, Texas barbecue has earned its stripes in the culinary world. Pitmasters from Texas are often seen as celebrities in the world of barbecue, showcasing their skills in international competitions and food festivities, further cementing the global footprint in Texas barbecue. But what really makes Texas barbecue special is its role in the social fabric of Texas life. Barbecue in Texas isn't just food, it's a cultural event. Whether it's a family reunion, a community celebration, or just a weekend get-together, barbecue is at the heart of it. It's about more than just eating, it's about sharing stories, making memories, and enjoying good company. The smoky aroma of brisket on the pit is a call to gather, to take a moment to slow down and savor both the food and the company. From the bustling barbecue joints in Austin, to the roadside smokehouses in small town Texas, barbecue brings people together creating a sense of community that's hard to find anywhere else. When you talk about Texas barbecue, you're talking about a culinary landscape as vast and diverse as the state itself. Each barbecue joint has its own story, its own secret rub, and a dedicated following. Take Franklin Barbecue in Austin, for instance, a place that's become almost synonymous with Texas barbecue. People line up for hours, sometimes before sunrise, just to get a taste of their legendary brisket. Known for its perfect bark and melt-in-your-mouth texture, then there's the Snow's Barbecue in Lexington, a small-town joint that's gained big-time fame, especially for their succulent meats smoked by the legendary pitmaster, Tootsie Tomanets. But it's not just about the big names. There's a wealth of barbecue joints with each their own unique flair. In Lockhart, known as the barbecue capital of Texas, you'll find places like Cruz Market and Smitty's Market, where the focus is on the meat so flavorful they forgo sauce altogether. Over in Houston, you've got spots like Killian's Barbecue, blending traditional Texas style with innovative twists. What's fascinating is how competition and innovation keeps the Texas barbecue scene vibrant. These pitmasters aren't just cooking, they're constantly experimenting, fine-tuning their methods, and pushing the boundaries of traditional barbecue. It's this blend of respect for tradition and a willingness to innovate that keeps Texas barbecue at the forefront of the culinary world. From using different types of wood, to experimenting with rubs and sauces, or even playing with different meats and cuts, the diversity is endless. For more videos, subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon. Comment down below what your thoughts are on these food items.